Bruce and I used to call it the Gotham Building. Like even taxi drivers know it as the Gotham, the Batman Building. This building was built 16 years ago by C.S. Wong. He was very inspired by the 1920s Art Deco era, so this building was very inspired by that. Hi, my name is Yana and I'm a bartender at Atlas Bar Singapore. Every time I step into this building, I'm just in awe. Like every day, you notice new details about this building. In the day, the bar feels very different, and then when it goes to night shift, the music gets livelier. The lights will start to dim. So I fell in love with bartending about four years ago. I used to work as a barista at this cafe and it was just five minutes away from 28 Hong Kong Street. I used to go to that bar a lot. Every time I watched them, I would just get so mesmerized. It's like, oh, they were really like dramatic with their hand gestures, their shaking and all that. And I really wanted to do that because I love attention. <laughs> The most expensive bottle we have is the Shipwreck Champagne. It's about 110 years old and it will cost you about $190,000. So in Singapore, you can buy a small two-room HDB flat with it to put it into comparison. Apparently, it was served on the Titanic. It was not salvaged on the Titanic. <laughs> on this tower, we have one of the largest gin collections in the world, a vintage Macallan. We actually sold a bottle for about $7,000 to a guest before, and a shot will cost you about $550. We have people that buy it for their girlfriends for their birthdays, so if anybody wants to buy it for my birthday. <laughs> People think it's kind of like a man's job. It has happened to me personally, like people not wanting me to be the bartender. <laughs> like people see me behind the bar, it's like, excuse me, can I speak to the bartender, please? <laughs> me. <laughs> it's a personal preference, maybe, you know. I'm not gonna say they are traditional or they are sexist or anything, but times have changed, you know. We are in 2019 now. Anyone and everyone can do a job if they really want to. It's so nice to see that there's a lot of female bartenders just popping out in the scene. A drink is as good as who you are behind the bar, really. Yeah. So I strive for that every day. <laughs>